everyone, Enrique Zinigu Jr. here, and happy birthday to me! Yeah, that's right, I have turned 26 years old this year. I appreciate y'all for the birthday wishes and stuff down in the comments below, and especially to the ones who submitted their birthday celebratory videos to me through the Google form in my 26th birthday celebratory Q&A video campaign. Now, I did this last year for my 25th birthday, so I decided to bring it back this year, but with a little twist, the Q&A part. So basically, you can have the option to answer me a question or not and stuff. So like, you can, you can ask me a random question, yeah, as long as it's nothing personal, that I would answer it for y'all on video and such. But yeah, and that's what I'll do later on in this video. So yeah, I mean, 26? I mean, I mean, I know I should feel older year by year, but but I still feel young at heart because I'm, I feel like I'm still a young adult, you know, at this moment, but still. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, now I'm gonna present the videos that you guys have submitted to me in this video. So here we go. Let's check them out, shall we? What is up, everybody? Hassan and Red here. We're here to wish Enrique Zuniga Jr. a happy 26th birthday. Happy birthday, Enrique. We hope for many more years to come from me and Red. And we're always here, here to support you, my friend. Happy birthday, Enrique. We hope for many more years to come. Happy birthday, my friend. Aw, oh, well thank you so much, Hussein and Red. I very appreciate your birthday wishes for me. Thank you so much. Happy 26th birthday, E.R.K. Senior Jr. I hope you have a great and awesome birthday, my great guy. And here's a question we'd like to ask you. Wait, 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 stop the video! It seems like we got our first question from Michael and Benjamin. All right, let's see what they had to ask me. What's your opinion on regular show? Ah, oh, what is my opinion on regular show? Well, I think regular show is an awesome, funny, and regular show. Oh! <laughs> jolly good show. Jolly, jolly good show. That's what, that's what I had to say about it. <laughs> Alright, anyways, NEXT! Hey, Enrique, I just want to make this clear real quick and say happy birthday. And my question is, what was the first character you ever voiced as? in one of video projects. Oh, question alert! We got another question from Emil and she's asking me what was my first character I voiced as in one of the video projects. Well, if you're talking about Tiffany's Avengers on Colorful Island and stuff, which that started for me, was the character Wade. The little green hatchling who is the troublemaker and prankster that we all know and love, who just loves to, you know, do pranks and such. Especially for his mischievous, evil <laughs> chuckle. Yeah, and it's actually voiced by me. So, yeah, Wade was my first character. You know, I get to voice at, uh, voice as in one of the video projects out there on the on the internet. So, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, next. What is up, you guys? Blue Jay plays here, also known as the Blue Jay player, and I want to wish. A happy birthday to Enrique Zaniga Jr., my best friend for six years. Yes, that is right. My friend Enrique has finally had his birthday. I'm very proud of how far he's come and everything in between. He's a really good friend. He's been the most inspiring of all. We have had so much good moments together. We have had so many good experiments together. Like We have done so many things together to make things work work especially like when we do our Fortnite compilations together or we even do like crazy stuff and we're just the prime example of best friends comedy is awesomeness like I really appreciate my best friend for who he is not only as a person but as a great friend too because let's be for real Enrique is the goat around these parts he's been doing YouTube way longer than me I only started in 2016 and he started in 2015 he might have to correct me in his birthday video but yeah oh. <laughs> but yeah so basically though he's a great friend and I pretty much wanted to come on this birthday video and tell you guys that to wish this man a beloved happy birthday and everything from the bottom of my heart Enrique happy birthday I hope you have a marvelous birthday and make sure make sure you have a birthday cake. And also tell Isabella I said hi. Oh. <laughs> All right, you guys. My talking's done here. Take care. Bye. Well, <laughs> Nick. You must make me cry. Uh, 
Oh man, oh, that was touching, Nick. Yeah, we've been through so much together for the past uh, six for the past six years and such of our friendship. Holy moly! Yeah, I mean, thank you so much, Nick. I mean, this that, I know that was a lo I know I know, guys, that was a, one of the longest videos that uh, I've ever received. But but Nick here, go! Like, he got me. He got he touched my heartstrings for sure on that one. Uh, yeah, we've had we've had our moments in gaming and such, and just uh, having some laughs together and some all that kind of all that kind of funny shenanigans we do on this and stuff. So, yeah, uh, thank you so much, Nick, for your birthday wishes. I mean, it means so much, man. Thank you very much. Uh, that was so sweet. He almost made me freaking tear up on video. Take it, boy. <laughs> Happy 26th birthday, Enrique, my number one bestie. Ah, well, thank you so much, Tiffany, for your birthday wishes for me. I very appreciate you and your, your love and support in the, the videos I do and such on my channel and such. I very appreciate you as an artist and such for the Amy Birds community. And uh, yeah, so I'm forever grateful to actually make friends who is a big Angry Birds fan, you know, and uh, who is well known in the Angry Birds community and, and such. So. Yeah, I very appreciate you, Tiffany, from the bottom of my heart. Thank you so much. All right, let's move on to the next video. Next! Hi, everyone, and hi, Enrique. This is Bailey Jackson Blue, a.k.a. BJ Blue Productions. I'd like to say happy 26th birthday to you, Enrique. I hope you enjoy your special day, and I want to sincerely thank you for being such an amazing friend and for your amazement. I know by this point you have quite a variety of favorite franchises, but I especially know that Angry Birds and My Little Pony are two of your top favorites. Speaking of franchises, something I'd like to ask you is how did you first discover your most favorite franchises and how did you get into them? I'm especially wondering about this in terms of Amy Birds and My Little Pony. Oh, we got another question. Question alert. <laughs> so BJ Blue Productions asked me, how did I first discover my most favorite franchises and how do I get into them? So basically in basic terms is that how did I get into Angry Birds and My Little Pony and such and stuff like that. Well, BJ Productions, uh, well, the first time I discovered Angry Birds was, uh, the time back in 2010 where my dad was playing the game on his iPad and I heard, you know, the, the, um, the slingshot noise and the, the bird noises and stuff in the background when I was a kid. And I, and, I asked, and I asked my dad, I was like, what are you playing? And he said, Angry Birds. And I was like, oh, that sounds interesting <laughs> at, at first. But that's not until he lent me his iPad and I tried the game out for, him, for myself. And ever since I launched that first bird and I was like, wow. A game that you could actually use your finger like a touch screen and you know back then it was just, yeah and uh, from there on out uh, I got addictive to Angry Birds and that's how I became an Angry Birds fan since then because uh, I enjoyed the game so much and uh, yeah now as for My Little Pony I didn't get into My Little Pony since 2015 when uh during the time when uh, season five of my little pony friendship is magic was premiering but i think it seems like for some reason i got recommended a youtube video that involves my little pony or something i don't know but <laughs> i don't know i mean to think that what started for me was when i watched a clip of an episode of my little pony friendship is magic on youtube and i think that was the episode um season five episode five tanks for the memories yeah, I can't you not, guys. That was the episode I first got into the franchise, and it was cute, friendly, you know, and nice to watch at first, but I did not know any of the characters of the ponies until I binge-watched the show. So right there and then, I got into the series by watching the first episode of the show, and then from there on out, yep, I, that's how I freaking got into my little pony franchise magic. <laughs> and uh, how I became a brony and such, so... Yeah, that's what it all started for me and such, so, yeah. <laughs> Other than that, thank you very much once again for our connections and interactions, and congrats on your YouTube evolution for all your years active, and cheers to 26 years. Thank you guys all so much for submitting your birthday videos to me and such, and I really appreciate all your uh, birthday wishes and, and stuff, guys. I really appreciate it. You made my 26th birthday even a bit more special and than I could have, uh, you know, thought and imagined. So I really appreciate it, guys, from the bottom of my heart. Thank you guys all so much. 
I really mean it. So yeah, guys, that's gonna do it for this 26th birthday video that I put together for you guys. I mean, hope you guys all enjoyed that. If you guys are new here to the channel and that you love the content and videos I do on the channel, then like I said, guys, if you're new here to the channel, then please don't forget to like this video and subscribe today to my YouTube channel as well. And don't forget to hit that notification bell while you're at it today, guys. Never miss a brand new video. Anyways, guys, take care of y'all. Stay safe out there. And I will see y'all in the next video. Bye-bye.